He was the WAC player of the year a season ago. Don't leave Ford open. Do not leave Jordan Ford alone. You will pay the price. Right now, the 50-50 balls all going St. Mary's way. They're making the effort plays. Defensively, offensively, second chance opportunities just haven't been able to convert. Oh, nice touch pass underneath. And Gavin Baxter gets BYU on the board. And signed with an agent that wasn't NCAA certified. So when he wanted to come back to school, he had to pay a nine-game price to start off the season. Eight to shoot. It's with Jordan Ford. He's going to try and create. He's got it back for three. Yes! Field goals in the first eight minutes for St. Mary's, and they are both Jordan four threes. Hawes turns the corner, throws one up, and throwing it down is Gavin Baxter. Hawes stays home defensively, forces the miss. Yoli Childs had the rebound. Try to flip past to Celius. It's a turnover. Here's Fitz. Yes! Marcelo just jumped that, didn't allow that handoff action right back to Jordan Ford. Ford, the floater, goes. That's the first time he's been able to turn the corner and get downhill. Look at all four of the coaches here tonight. Todd Golden, extremely young, but using his analytics and the elite level job. I, I think, by the way, watching that, San Francisco should be in the NIT. Yoli Childs over Perry. It's another three. As Jordan Ford hit a tough fadeaway, and now he gets a hand in, creates the steal, and goes to the basket and lays it in. Yoli Childs to his left. Again a miss. Celius, offensive rebound, plus the foul, and BYU's got the lead back. Put yourself in position. You have to bring help. And that's about the third or fourth time that Malik Fitz is standing and watching on the weak side rather than initiating contact, boxing out. Early Childs in the post again. Plays catch with Hawks. Gets to the baseline, muscles it up and in. It's in the hands of a freshman. Now it's Ford. Back out to Fitz, five to shoot. Fitz off balance, his second field goal of the night. Makes it a two point or a one point game. Go right back to Childs. And they do. He goes right around the foul. Oh. He is met by Fitz. Tries again. Fitz takes it away. Rebs will throw it in. It's into Ford. Jordan Ford for the win. Got it! 1.4 seconds to go. I am really surprised that they didn't hit Hawes there in that moment. There's the touch. And that does it. Jordan Ford. It's the game winner.